So let's go to Thomas Lundsdill. Yeah, around, uh, more or less. Thomas is a WordPress uh, freelancer from Hamburg, Germany, and we will talk about why nobody, nobody likes the uh, native search of WordPress. Wonder why. Welcome to Thomas. So, um, I'm Thorsten, no Thomas, oh, it's <laughs> no problem. So, I hope this, yeah, it works, it works. Uh, it works for me, works for you, Serge. Is, is it working for you? For me, it not really works well. And uh, I asked this uh, question on, on social media in the last days and uh, got so many replies. And uh, the replies um, were, uh, you can't uh, filter for uh, an author date, uh, tags or categories. You can't exclude a page uh, or a post. Uh, you can't limit um, the search to just search uh, one custom post type, or you can't exclude one. Um, and you can't uh, set up the search for um, uh, searching for custom fields uh, without coding. So the search has its limits. So what does the search do? It searches the title, the excerpt, and the content with a very, very simple uh, full text SQL query. And it shows the results ordered by relevance. And it's a very simple sort of relevance. So, um, but what if you search for something that is part of a block name? So let me tell you a little story. I uh, searched the, the block from a, um, a colleague in uh, Germany, um, Bernard Kau. He, I know he um, has blocked about the syntax highlighter uh, brush for Apache snippets, and I, I know it. I just need to find this blog post. So I searched for syntax highlighter. And I was wondering, I got so many results, and they had the, even they don't have the search uh, term in them. And then I got it, I got every blog post with a code snippet in it. But why does this happen? This is because the block editor saves the block name and some settings in the uh, uh, HTML comment in the raw content. So every post with the syntax highlighter block um, was found through the SQL query in the raw content. But we do not want this comments to be searched. And uh, ignoring the comment is not enough because uh, there are often some CSS classes also and we need to get rid of them at least for the search. So we want to search for the content but not for the markup. I mean, th this is not a minor issue um, for some edge cases. With every new blog and every new setting, we are polluting the search more and more. And there are words now in WordPress which are essentially useless uh, for the search. You can't really search for paragraph or image or background. You will get every every blog post, or nearly every blog post. So what is the opinion from the leading developers in this case? Of course, um, I reported this issue. Unfortunately, this is a known issue in WordPress, because if you search for table, uh, you get results including the table tag. MySQL string searching isn't capable of uh, dealing with this kind of contextual parsing. And if you require 100% accurate search results, the best option is to use a dedicated search engine like Elasticsearch, says Gary Pendergast. So another comment I got was uh, one opportunity is um, 
for search backends to render the blocks fully before sending post content into the index. So we need to build up a known index. And I don't have any great ideas how to resolve this with MySQL. I'd love to hear of a solution if someone has one, says Daniel Bachuber. So solutions, please. I think Elasticsearch, uh, setting up El Elasticsearch is not what the, the um, typical user um, or client I have uh, would do. So, and um, building an own index in a new table is uh, too much to do for WordPress maybe. So I tried to find a simpler solution, something in between those two solutions. And I found one. With MySQL 8.0.4 and MariaDB 10.0.5 onwards, there is a new function called regexp replace. Now we can replace text um, via regular expressions in an SQL query. For example, we could remove every HTML comment before we do the search. Yes, this will, of course, um, have some um, performance impact, but for smaller sites, this could be acceptable. A dedicated index will be better, uh, and there are plenty of plugin solutions for it. Unfortunately, they still um, often do not solve the problem with those false positives. So um, let's have a look. Um, with the challenges. Uh, what about file names and alternative text? If we just remove the comments and maybe the CSS classes, um, then we will have a decent search uh, result and file names and alternative text will still be searchable. Short codes could be also removed, at least for the front end search. Um, we could um, do this just for um, those databases which supports it. So we could have this as a progressive enhancement. Um, and it's tricky to remove the complete markup because uh, we have non-encoded characters sometimes. The greater than, lower than character, sometimes it's not real reliable um, uh, that these are encoded correctly in the database. There's a whole years old track ticket about it. <laughs> um, and some page builders are um, using JSON to save uh, data and maybe we need more adjustments uh, to help those uh, edge cases to have a decent search. So um, my conclusion is uh, we have those focus on the four faces and the four faces are a necessary uh, way to, to focus the work on the most important uh, part uh, we want to do at one time. But now, after some years, I think we need to look at those things that we have left behind. And the search, one of the most basic advantages of a CMS, is missing much uh, needed features um, and is not e easy to extend without coding. Um, I will skip this part. Um, sometimes uh, the philosophy of decisions, not options, uh, need to be adjusted. Important features like SEO, sitemaps, or the search um, would be much better with at least some basic settings. So um, if I have three <laughs> free wishes, I would love to have more search features in core. I would love to have um, at least some basic search settings. And um, the part I skipped is about um, translation strings, which are um, not containing text, but uh, settings, settings um, that are used to switch things on and off or um, um, set things up. And uh, those uh, translations are missing um, safeguards. Uh, so you can translate them wrongly and break things. So um, if you want to help me get this fixed, please talk to me. Um, I'm Zodiac1978 uh, on social media. Um, I have collected more information 
and some links on this uh, page. Um, uh, yeah, and thank you for being here and hear my talk. Thanks, Thorsten. Ah. Thanks so much. A gift for you. Thank you, thank you. for being here.